When to suspect TB in a child? What is TB? Tuberculosis, TB, is a contagious bacterial infection, primarily affecting the lungs. But it can also spread to other parts of the body. It is caused by the bacterium Mycobacterium tuberculosis. And it is spread through the air. When an infected person coughs, sneezes, or spits. While TB is preventable and curable, it remains a significant global health concern. What are the types of TB? There are two types of TB, based on contagiousness of disease. Latent TB and active TB. Let's discuss them one by one. Latent TB In latent TB, the bacteria are present in the body, but the immune system keeps them under control, thus preventing the development of active disease and symptoms. People with latent TB cannot spread the infection to others. Active TB Active TB is when the bacteria multiply and cause symptoms, making the person contagious. People with active TB can spread the bacteria to others, through the air. Now let's get on to the main topic. When to suspect TB in a child? Every child less than 14 years old should be suspected of TB. If the child has an unexplained illness, and that illness is prolonged for more than two weeks, with one or more of the following cases. Chronic cough. Child has a cough for more than two weeks. Cough is not improving and may have a sputum. Fever. Child has a history of low-grade fevers around 99 degrees Fahrenheit. Fever occurs usually at evening. Child usually has no fever during daytime. Child may also have a history of sweating at night. Enlarged lymph nodes. Child usually has enlarged cervical lymph nodes. On examination, cervical lymph nodes will be enlarged, painless, may be matted, may have an abscess. Failure to thrive. Child has failure to gain weight. And his body has not yet responded to one-month dietary plan. History of contact with other TB patients. Ask whether the child had any contact with an adult with chronic cough or an adult who has TB within last two years. HIV infected child. Ask whether the child has HIV or assess the child to see if he has any HIV signs and symptoms. Do screening test of HIV if you suspect that the child has HIV-related signs and symptoms.